Howdy, welcome back. We're preparing for the holy war to hopefully win. If that makes sense. Either way, let's press alternates on all of these boats. Get all of them to ship over there. That we won't suffer. I won't suffer the attrition anyway. But yeah, let's get them all over. In fact, I don't need some of them. Let's use this, don't I? That needs a good two thousand men on it. Also, you guys are gonna go that way. I'll re reallocate the men afterwards. Get everyone over on this side of the map to hold off. Got our friend coming in to join us. Terrific. Still making money. Hopefully Pope Man can see fit to help us out a bit. First off, let's leave a f some of you behind. We'll take 3,000 for the siege. Or 2,966. Shit him over to Gaben. Gabez. Ah, Gabe. Whoa. Trishan City. Get out of there, men. We need you all. Nice. Harm, apparently. Why are we being harmed? Also, what in his land could we do? Well, we could siege it, but. That's what I meant. So, to get these guys over there. Just a few hundred will be more than useful. So, who was it? Oh, it was you guys. Had 14 men and no ships. You guys had ships and no men. You guys need a siege general if there is one. If they even exist in this game, but. Yep, you get zero. Have fun, zero. Now, this is not including my own personal men because they are expensive. Children, get educated. There's Vassal Levis somewhere. It's just your 14, though. We also do have Lyon coming over as well, so that's a big help. Antonio, you have the other guys. You don't. I'll leave the centre because I'm the boss. Alright, I'll do. All these ships. Lovely, nice to meet you. Can you half you up? I could make a move on his land and siege him out. That might be able to uh, speed things up. Because I'm going to be sieging that and then that's going to give me stuff. Or I could just wait and let him try and attack into me. Neither, none of these places are actually defensive. Wait. These are defensive against Farmer. Well, let's split these guys up. You guys are marching all the way over here. You have your three. You have another three. You go in there. These fellas. Or there, even other three. Or just that guy. We get on the ship. We can go straight to Alexandra. Right, if I can hold that and get the defensive bonus when he eventually wants to come over, that will help us out a lot against his big, powerful, undefeatable horses. Right, and that matches them too, so you're going to go in there and attack. Alright, everyone's still reinforcing. That's nice. I'll stop with this wife thing. Okay, no, I trust her. What does he want? My niece. Well, I'd accept it, but let's see what it's going to be doing here. Alright, so that's cool. We have the defensive area here set up. If he wants to attack, he'll be attacking into us over a crossing. That might help. Might. Well, also, we have the Leonese over here. Let's hope we finish these sieges fast and get everyone over. I could use them. It was, oh, he's having big revolts. Poor guy. Oh, that's what I should have done. Made them family members so I could call them in as well. Every little helps. Has he got any friends joining him? He does. He has Mr. Blessed with his big 6k stack over there. Oh, he's made capital now, Damascus. And now he's got 42,000 men again. Ugh. But he should already have his men raised, where he's off fighting in another war. 
which will hopefully give us a chance. Right, now what? Well, I could stop paying guys and then get some cheaper mercenaries. No, I wouldn't. I could only be able to afford a few thousand, like that stack. I'd be better off paying my own men if I was going to do something like that. Speaking of my own men, let's get you over here ready just in case I need them. That's out of two castles, all that lot. Whoa. I suppose there's the house, but they are expensive. So that'll be 21 coins a month for them lot. Maybe spend 25 on them though. Let's put that down and see how much we make. Maybe it'll be an option. Sort of reinforcing these guys all that much. Which is only a few extra hundred for the same cost. Could just pay my own men over. We'll see. Well, I actually could. But let's give them a tick to make me some more cash. We can try shipping them over. Oh, it doesn't actually work like that then, does it? Ah, what well on you? Skill no, 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 you're not. Alright, so let's call up these bad boys. So it looks like we are making money off them. Apparently I'm paying for men, but that's not the case and we know it. Let's wait a month to see what happens here. It's called Sultan Usurper Sadajuk. Well, he's not that powerful, is he? Yeah, we're making money here, so let's get you guys over here. Whoa, he attacked me. I didn't even notice. See? That's not even my general stack. Right, get in there, men. He's got... F Whoa, I've got horse archers. He's got 3,000, but I've got horse archers. Right, you guys are on the way, yeah? They sure are, because I need you. We can have a few thousand more here. Still not enough. I've got three horse archers, though. You can't... Oh, I've got two. One died. That's a shame. He's also lost a lot of his. And we pushed him off. We lost 16,000 of them. Get wrecked, Sunny Jim. Where's he retreating to? Maruba. Looks like he's going over here. And we killed this guy. Well, that is a good start, if there ever was one. Put well, his numbers right down to my own level. Hopefully, we won't get too much attrition here while we just route them off. There we go. Goodbye to his men. Which might mean he's now able to um, re-raise, but I'm not sure. Unless we can stick men on Cairo, that's going to be worth war score, surely. Or oh, the men, the matter. Or we could always do both. Or three, because we've got three stacks here. If that's enough men, it might not be in some cases. We can always spare off other men for any other sieges. And just have, like, Damieta and Cairo under siege. Alright, so whenever I look away, pause. That's the new rule. Also get you guys on there so you're easy to move out. What? They've moved into my land? Come on, get out. I get you 800 extra men, but no ships for them. Also, another 800 from you. Let's get you. Let's get you. Whoa, 1,000. Okay. Let's ship you guys over to go pick them up. Was that an extra few men I could use very much? Right, yeah, you can't actually see them there. How many more do you need? A couple of hundred. Well, we have that much. Alright, come on. 
Yeah, siege out this stuff. Have the war finished. Complete the conquest of Africa and not lose a big battle. Imprison this guy. I'm not feeling like it right now, if I'm honest. Okay, perfect. Your signal going, Ellie? Oh, wrong province. Of course I did. Alright, you guys are going to get on. Go pick them up. Their Caesars are coming through. Lovely. He's coming in for round two on this place. So you guys are going to get in there and back. You guys are going to get in there and back. And get in there, back. Over there, back. Uh, yeah, I don't want to take any risks. We're all going over. Initially, we're going to be outnumbered. When's he arrive? 3rd of July. 3rd of July? 13th. 5th. Okay. Yeah, we are going to be outnumbered a bit. Rather a bit. Uh, come on, bros. Let's hold the line. You have men on the way. Just hold on. If we repel him here, we should have the war. If not, it's going to be great difficulty because I don't have any more men anywhere. It seems like we're losing. We need to get all these men in there. Get to it, gentlemen. There we go. Outnumber him now. It should help. He's only got 760 horse archers, but it's still horse archers. Meanwhile, I've got two. Hopefully that will help me out somewhat. Yeah, we seem to be smashing him out again. Kill his men. Kill them all. Quick. Lovely. He's lost 14,000. That'll do. The trick. And we're up to 94. Okay. Well, just in case, let's stick some more men over here. So I thought we could just storm a cast and win it from that. We might win it here. If you guys can do that for me, I'd appreciate it. They seem quite equal. We've got the morale. I mean, perfect. Nice. 94, who's this guy? Kida. The bastard grandson. The bastard great grandson of Saladin. Salah Adin. Right, I need to spare a few more men again. I'll do for you. How many men do you need? Quite a lot. But these guys can spare it. So uh, they will spare it. Just in case I do need the sieges, we may as well make sure we have them. But this siege here could be enough. Or I could just continue playing anyway. If I have 100%, I can enforce demands. So for one province. Get on high. Yeah, there's 99. We have it. Oh, that went well. Not well enough, though, was it? And he's coming in again. What's he playing at? This crazy, crazy old man. Right, I'm going to split you guys up. Yeah, let's just, just uh, continue sieging him afterwards. Take his stuff, take his money. I'm not going to continue to play. The game's just a bit too buggy for my liking, so I'm going to do some E4 mod. I'm not sure which. Maybe the Game of Thrones. Maybe extended timeline. I'm going to do something. And they'll be coming out in a few days. Not sure when, but yeah, we'll just chill out. In fact, now let's get out of here. Offer peace and force demands. Get out of here, you gentleman. Calling our friend against that guy? Apparently we can't. Anyway, everyone back to the ships. So I've taken this land and everything underneath it. Now you did siege it, but I'm thinking someone over here. You are the lord of this land. You can have it. You can have Gaben. Which means he now likes me. I mean, how could you not like me? I'm going to get all my men together, and then we're going to go off and defeat these rebels. Don't have smallpox, please, milady. Milady.
lady, do not have this. You're not supposed to have this, my lady. Why, my lady? Alexandria. What a place. Yeah, let's find you. Send people out to find it. Might not have enough time. What's that as well? Silk Road. Ah, right. Oh, of course, I've got Horse Lords on now. Yes, that's what it is. I forgot about that. Thank you. Thank you, good old chap. Subscribers at their finest. Giving me free DLC. Thank you. YouTubing does get expensive. Gee. You get a... You get a guy giving you a free DLC. It just helps out so much. As you two, you got to pay for the electricity and all the uploading. Each one of these 20 minute videos probably has about an hour plus of being uploaded. Yeah, that's why I do 720 HD. I don't do 1080p past episode 10 or 12 or the first recording session. Because it's just, they take twice as long for not that much difference and then it's costing me twice as much not only through uh, electricity but through time you won't be able to upload hardly as much Ugh. yeah you can be spared let's get a new spy master for the last few seconds of the game that guy he'll do nicely get to it ain't nothing to it gangster rap made me do it right let's attack 28,000 man stack. Let's go. Including my own personal men for once. Virginia. Alright. So how many men? Yeah, we lost a few of them. But you guys. Let's fight. I should be leading here. Yes, I am. Looks like I didn't have armor on. Anyway, smash. Ah, brilliant. They're dead. So, uh, men. You're free, everyone's everyone's free. Go home. I'm not my retinue, you're not free. Yeah. Fleet is free. You guys get paid for. But I think that is now the end of the series. We took Genoa, a small uh, republic, and we expanded. We took over the islands around here, then we took over Naples, we took over the whole of North Africa. Including Mauritania and Africa. Not Egypt. Could have gone for Egypt, but the game is just... I don't fancy it. How many wars would it be, anyway? One, two, three, four. Yeah, there'll be four more wars. It's just... The game's not... It's a bit too buggy for my liking. I'll come back after they've patched it. And I've done some European Universalis mods. But yeah, there we go. Also, religion. Mostly North African Catholic. Very much, mostly. Also took over Iberia in the end. I gave away some of the land because of border gore, but yeah. It's quite a nice looking... Looking, uh, do you know what here? Opinions, most people like me. Direct vassals is these guys. Uh, trade zones, Genoa is strong. We have land over here. Oh, Visby's gone over and done their thing there. What's this there? Economic, very rich Europe. What else we got? Government types, of course. Merchant Republic, uh, feudal over there, tribal feudal, feudal, ikta, tribal. Yeah, Merchant Republic, all the red is glorious. What else have I got? Family trade zones? Nope. Trade zones already done. Uh, dynasties. Fear SJ. Oh yeah. Revolt risk, uh, quite high in some places. But anyway, yeah, that's that. So let's open the Chronicle. Just have a little flick through. If you want to uh, pause and read, then uh, go ahead. I'll give you about a second per slide. As you can see, we've been through a little bit. A little bit indeed. Was defeated in the battle of that against the armies of Aragon. That's a shame. Supported Basilius and Anatolius. Is he alive now? Yeah, looks like it's current. No. No, maybe he's not. Uh, 18 to How long did he play for? I'll check this a second. After I finish off the book, I'll close it, reopen it up again. It's something we played for. Quite a while. I mean, this was over 30 videos now. I think it's 31 videos. 
Let's close it, open up Chronicle again. Oh god, just... I thought that might have been an easy way of doing it, but no. 1187 to 12, so nearly 100 years. That's that's plenty for a playthrough. But anyway, like I said, I will see you guys in my next series, which will be Europa Universalis Mod. Either Extended Timeline or Game of Thrones, I've not made my mind up, but I'll see you then. Bye-bye.